Hi, this is Marilee and this is week four of my six week blogging challenge. So this week I have been, uh, to be honest, having a little bit of a harder time with scheduling. I've had a lot to do at work and most of my focus has gone there. Uh, it's like I want to be the best employee I can and I, I find that most of my time is spent just making sure all my projects get done. And, um, and then when I come home, it's a little bit later and, and I find that, okay, I can't put in two week or 20 minutes here or there. So I've, I've been kind of slacking a little bit. So, um, I, but I'm aware of it. I know that this is something that I need to be better at. And, and like I've mentioned in my, my, other video is that I can't be too hard on myself because things happen. It's things don't always go according to plan. And so uh, you have to plan for the unexpected pretty much. And so I'm, I'm, uh, I'm not going to get too hard on myself and just know that this is, uh, this is something that I will do better th next time. What I want to do for next week is I want to refocus since this week kind of got away from me next week i want to be more vigilant because i committed to this six week challenge i want to uh, i want to finish and make sure that i do everything that that i want to do so i know that next week is going to be a little bit lighter there are a few things that i need to to reschedule because i want to make this happen and so i'm going to dedicate a little bit more time and uh be able to write another blog post and um, and maybe two if I have time, but I at least want to commit to what I have already, but hopefully throw in some more things that I've been thinking about. So the tip I have for this week is this, give yourself a break. You don't have to be perfect at everything. Uh, know that things get in the way, life gets in the way. So the best thing that you can do is try better next time and and don't feel too bad if things don't go according to plan even though i didn't hit all the goals this week i still wanted to share a nonprofit with you don't be a monster.org and this is such a unique nonprofit i wanted to read this to you so i don't mess it up it's the largest nonprofit organization in the haunted attraction community they offer free unique and entertaining anti-bullying assemblies for students in the fourth through tenth grades they work to educate and empower youth to be leaders around diversity, in inclusiveness, and show them how to stand up for their friends and peers. This is a great organization, and if you wanna learn more about them, check out the link. Well, I better get going if I'm going to refocus on my blog, so uh, tune in next time, and I'll share what I have for you next week. Don't forget to submit your stories. Bye.